My name is Wisnu Jaya Pratama. My name is Octavian Wikis Cahyo. We, we are, we are in a robotic. Our age is 12 years old. Our school is STM Media for Surabaya. We are from amazing country, Indonesia. About our experience, we have been studying robotics since 9 years old. Study programs, line follower, line base, gathering, transporter, sumo, and rescue. About RCIP, this is our first time joining RoboCup competition. The exclusive summary of preliminary challenge. About our category, we participate in co-space challenge autonomous driving, first steps, U12 category. About our problems in this challenge, we have to investigate the robot to be able to follow the line and pass the intersection properly. About our methods to solve the problem, we have some methods. First is following the line. We prioritize to detect the middle sensor first, L1 and R1 sensors, so a robot will run smoothly. The second is pass the intersection. We make statement when robot detects R1, R2, and R3 sensors at the same time, robot will turn right sharply, but we prioritize so robot will pass the intersection properly. About our results, the results after we apply that method, our robot can run smooth and properly. Finally, we can reach finish line around 31 seconds. About our conclusion, to achieve maximum results, we must think critically after tried many times. We have two best methods. The first is prioritize middle sensors, and the second is turn right sharply when three right sensors sense black line. Analysis The challenge mission In this challenge, we have mission to make the robot can detect line smoothly and pass the intersection properly. But our mini tasks. This challenge can be broken down to mini tasks for make we easier to complete the task. We broke down the task to first follow the line, second one pass the intersection. About overall missions. After we broke down the missions into mini tasks, of course the robot can solve the challenge. Because although we broke down into several mini tasks, the robot will combine that together into one big task, so robot can solve all the mission. The AI algorithm and resource. About AI algorithm, first we prioritize when R1, R2, and R3 sensors sense black line. Robot will turn right very hardly. Then when L1, L2, and L3 sense black line, robot will move forward. Then when L1 and R1 sensors sense black line, robot will move forward. Then when L1 sensor sense black line, robot will turn left very slightly. Then, when R1 sensor sends black line, robot will turn very slightly. Then, when L1 and L2 sensors sends black line, robot will turn left slightly. Then, when R1 and R2 sensors sends black line, robot will turn right slightly. Then, when L2 sensors sends black line, robot will turn left slightly. Then, when R2 sensors sends black line, robot will turn right slightly. Then, when L2 and L3 sensors sends black line, robot will turn left hardly. Then, when R2 and L3 sensors sends black line, robot will turn right hardly. Then, when 
Elmi sensor sends black line. Robot will turn left hardly. Then, when R3 sensor sends black line, robot will turn right hardly. About tools and resources, in this challenge, we use flowchart as a tool. About our advantage of tools and resources. Advantage from using flowchart as a tool is to help make our logic think properly, so our robot will move right and necessary. Implementation About our methods, to solve the problems, we have some methods. First, following the line, we prioritize to detect the middle sensors first, L1 and R1 sensor, so robot will run smoothly. Second one, pass the intersection. We make statement when robot detects R1, R2, and R3 sensor at the same time. Robot will turn right sharply, very prioritized, so robot will pass the intersection properly. This is our flowchart. Debugging We cannot be denied if we face some problems during the challenge. The usually problems is we put wrong sensor or speed. To fix that, we broke down step by step to search which problems we had. The process Robot face problems, and then break down one by one the program, and then found the problem, and then challenge the program and try another program, and then robot run properly. The conclusion and first of work. About our results to achieve maximum results, we must think critically. After tried many times, we have two best methods. First is prioritize middle sensors, and the second is turn right sharply when redirect sensors sends black line. Our improved strategy. If we face some challenge again, we already know the details about the challenge. Of course, we can improve it to be better, especially the time. We can skip the experimental pace so we can solve the problem faster. Learning experience Cospace Robot App We got new experience in programming about virtual robots and it's my first time. Very insightful. RCIP Tianjin 2021 Cospace Challenge We got new experience in participating in international robotic competition and we can train our competitive spirit also. Cospace Game Challenge In this Cospace Game Challenge, we hope we can share to each other participants about the methods that we use, so we can get more knowledge in this competition. Thank you for the attention! Bye!